hi honey welcome to my channel or welcome back to my channel my name is b if you're new here i do have information about me down below in the description box i have another general reading for you guys so we're gonna get right into it all right honey so here's what i'm seeing for you guys there was somebody desperately trying to get your attention this is somebody who comes from a very negative past so they have had like a lot of heartbreak a lot of pain i'm also seeing that this person okay i'm gonna be straight up honest this person does not feel worthy of you they don't feel worthy of being in your energy being around you at all just to get straight to the point with you but 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 okay and it's a big but this person is letting me know that they worship you with the queen of cups here this person sees you as the most beautiful person in the entire world entire world they also see that you are somebody who's very loving and nurturing i'm getting big time divine feminine energy from you whatever gender you may be um, and what that looks like is you're somebody who naturally is a helper you like to take care of others there's something here about your cooking as well like you may be a good cook a good chef um but you heal people just with your energy a lot of people are attracted to you but this person that i'm picking up on today this heart heartbroken person they are really tying on to your energy they are stuck on your energy uh, also sorry if you can hear my dog eating in the background he's a little hungry so with that being said i feel like you don't know just how deep this person's emotions truly are for you we do have the moon here so i'm seeing that this person is hiding a lot of their emotions a lot of their emotionality because they're uncomfortable almost it scares them just how infatuated and in love they are with you yeah they really love you we have the ace of cups okay ace of cups they love you more than you can even imagine and i feel like they've talked to their friends about this there's been like some communication with their friends letting their friends know like oh my, oh my gosh <clears throat> as i say that my throat chakra um letting their friends know like oh my gosh there's this amazing person aka you queen of cups the queen of cups is so beautiful i want their attention i want to talk to them i want to get to know them more so they've really been communicating with their friend group trying to like come up with an idea or get advice from their friends on how they can come forward and approach you i'm hearing this person just wants to like talk okay like even if you were to just say hi to this person it would make their entire day i'm hearing that they have tried to manifest some type of communication from you um they may be using like spell work or they may be trying to like manifest um they're really getting <clears throat> into like spirituality because they want to connect with you it's crazy because i'm seeing like this person knows that they need to communicate with you with the ace of swords they know that if they truly want you they have to make sure that you know and it's not just that they're telling their friends telling their family members about you it's about having to like sit you down and actually say hey i have strong feelings for you so they know that they need to do this but they are nervous because i'm hearing like you're intimidating okay whoever's watching this you're an intimidating person your personality is very intimidating your aura your energy that you give off is very intimidating and they sense this from you that you're not the type to like take any bs so if you sense even a little bit of negative energy you're the type to like put your defenses up and say no i don't want that you know so i'm getting that instead of just directly communicating with you and saying like hey i have feelings for you they're trying to take this psychic route and then they're trying to communicate with you that way we have the star so this is how this person sees you they see you see you as a star not only are you very affectionate loving and giving but you also shine bright i'm hearing like out of all the stars you shine the brightest 
and this is something that they're really attracted to okay um some of you your nickname could be star or that could be like your name your actual name but this person sees you as this ball of light that literally guides them so i did mention that this person is heartbroken at the moment the reason that they're heartbroken is because they may have found out that like you are involved with somebody else or they may have they may already know that you're involved with somebody else but they just it like breaks their heart okay to find out that you have someone else really shattered them it shatters their ego it makes them feel like it they, they feel hopeless that they're never going to be able to claim you as theirs and I'm seeing it has been very rough on them. I'm seeing that this is something that's just, it's bothering them. They can't sleep, okay? Their sleep is really being affected. This person really feels like you put a spell on them. I'm seeing this card here and this person really, like they're letting me know um, they're under your spell. They truly believe that you are a witch. Um, and if you're not a witch, like it doesn't make it true, but they just get this energy from you that whatever you pray to okay or whatever you worship or whatever you do if you're in the occult or whatever it is you can get whatever you want whatever you want and whoever you want and so because of this this person is just they cannot forget you they can't get you out of their mind especially at night at night they really like get emotional I'm hearing that they may even like cry over you. They cry over this connection. They cry thinking that you might be with another lover. They cry thinking like it's it's never gonna happen with you. I keep hearing this person say, in my wildest dreams. So they feel like to be with you, it would really be in their wildest dreams. It's only something that they can dream about. Okay, so what this person doesn't know um, I feel like you're also manifesting this person, okay? With the Ace of Cups here and Justice, you are manifesting this person because you see something special in them. You see that they are on your level and you see that they can be a good complement to you and your energy. And you also feel like this person understands you. Sometimes you get kind of like freaked out because you feel like this person may understand you better than you understand yourself. And I'm, I'm definitely seeing that this person knows how to love you, okay? So in case you're curious about that, like this person does have the potential to walk it like they talk it. So if they come towards you and they say like, look, Queen of Cups, I'm in love with you. I see you as this beautiful star. I want to have the whole world with you. I want to give you the whole world. Best believe this person is going to do whatever it takes to give you the whole world in your lap because they would do anything for you. Now here's another message that I'm getting. In the past, this person, the reason they're so heartbroken is because they made a bad decision. They made a bad judgment call. They decided to do something that affected this connection. So it's gonna be different for all of you that are watching, but the main message to take away from this is that they regret it. Every, I'm hearing every single fucking day, <laughs> I regret it, okay? So they regret it. They keep thinking about Oh, okay that makes sense so they're letting me know like they feel heartbroken because they broke your heart that's why and you know what i keep hearing that this person is just saying like if they can go back into time they would undo what they did or they would do it differently because a lot of you this person had the opportunity to approach you this person had the opportunity to get with you and they forfeited that they gave that to somebody else which is also another reason why we have the three of cups here because I just saw 1212 that number I've been seeing throughout all my general readings so if you've been watching all my videos throughout thank you so much <laughs> so I feel like this person just if they're in deep remorse they literally mourn the loss of you this is what this is they mourn the loss what's the matter what nasty boy mommy's doing a reading honey sorry okay but they mourn the loss because losing you losing you was the biggest 
downfall of their life. Losing you was the biggest mistake they could have ever made. And then not only that, but giving you, a, like kind of giving somebody else an opportunity to steal you away, they regret it every day. Every single day. I just saw 13, 13. You know what, you guys? You know what? Let me tell you something. We have the five of cups here. Okay. It doesn't matter who this person tries to be with. It doesn't matter, like, how many partners this person tries to have. I just saw 13, 31. It doesn't matter because nobody compares to you. So it's almost like this painful reminder that they're never going to find someone like you. They walk around their life trying to meet other people to see if they see you and other people and they don't because there's only one of you and this person is just heartbroken. 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 They're shattered in pieces. And you know what, honey? I feel like that's another reason why they don't want to come forward with communication is because I feel like they, they know that they fumbled the bag. They really did break your heart. I'm picking up that this person did something I, I just heard unforgivable. For a lot of you, this person could have like talked bad about you to their friends. It's funny because now they're talking nice about you to their friends. But in the past, they could have talked badly about you to their friends and then the reason they did this was because they were trying to act like they didn't have feelings for you. And they messed up. They messed up. Some of you may already know that. And others of you, you're going to find out in the future. This is like future energy. You're going to find out. And you're going to have a really hard time forgiving this person. All right. So the initials that we have, we have N Y S A R X Q W D Z. C P B G R E K R O X N I X C X U T N K. So I'm gonna see if I can find any words in here. All right, so I see the word bow, and automatically I think of Rihanna's song. I don't know if it's Rihanna, I'm pretty sure it is, but it's a song where she says, You look so dumb right now standing outside of my house trying to apologize you're so ugly when you cry okay so that's the song you can look up the lyrics and the song will come up when this person comes around a lot of you are going to say no thank you and others of you are going to say yes you're going to give this person a chance some of you other person other people you're going to say no so i'm seeing the word bored a lot of you may be very bored in this connection or you may be very bored like sitting around waiting for an apology um, and it's just very annoying that you have to wait for this. We also have the word cry. So like I said, this person is crying. They're crying over you. They're missing you. Oh yeah, we actually do have the word crying too. So we have cry. <laughs> okay, that makes sense. So a lot of you are like cry cry about it i don't care <laughs> and then others of you um the message is is that they're crying over you right we also have the word con so i feel like this person they tried to like put on a mask of who they wanted you to think they were they wanted you to they wanted to paint a nice picture of themselves and then you ended up finding out who they really are beneath the surface all right honey so that's actually all the words i'm seeing um before you go before i end this video 1212 has been following all of my generals so i just wanted to say um 1212 you can look that up online it's an angel number for you it's very obvious that your angels are trying to get your attention by giving you synchronicities 1212 usually means that you're taking the right steps in your true direction so basically it's encouragement to keep going down the path you're going because you're doing a good job and your spirit guides are also reminding you, um, I keep hearing like little bit by little bit. One, it's almost like one, two, one, two, you know, like a pattern of walking. So you just keep going. You, you put one foot over the other and you keep going. All right, honeys, if that resonated, show me some love by giving me a like, a comment down below. If you're new here, don't forget to subscribe. And like I always say, take care, be safe. I hope your life continues to stay as sweet as you are. Bye.